And the 2015 award for best documentary feature goes to The Look of Silence. <laughs> Joshua Oppenheimer, Sinje Berg Sorensen. Thank you to the IDA. Thank you to our uh, American distributors, participant media, and draft house. Thanks very much to our funders, a great mix of public service broadcasters in Europe, public film institutes in Denmark and Finland, and other foundations there, and uh, Berta Foundation, and Sundance uh, Documentary Film Program. Also, thank you very much to our colleagues in Denmark in Final Cut for Real and our co-producers making movies in Finland and Piraya Film in Norway. And not least, thank you to our anonymous in, uh, Indonesian crew who can't be here with us, but without, this, uh, without uh, whom this couldn't have happened at all. And not just the production of the film, but also bringing out the film in Indonesia. They're doing an amazing job. And last but not least, thanks so much to Ado, Adi Rukun and his family, our main protagonist. <laughs> Adi is an amazing guy. I mean, his uh, courage and his dignity uh, shows uh, or are the, the reasons that this film could be made at all. So thank you very much. I want to thank one person Sina didn't thank, and that's you, Sina Sorensen. Has produced both of my films, *The Act of Killing* and *The Look of Silence*, and is, I think, the finest nonfiction film producer in the world. I'm biased, but she is approaches everything with such honesty and patience and care and trust. And for that, I'm so grateful, as is everybody who worked on this film. The Indonesian genocide ended 50 years ago this year. But in a terrible way, it hasn't fully ended because the perpetrators are still in power and survivors continue to live in fear. Uh, film screenings of the look of silence have been attacked by paramilitaries and uh, paramilitary thugs working for the military and the military is pressured to have the look of silence banned from commercial cinema screenings in Indonesia so it's only been released through a network of community groups, NGOs, film clubs, universities. That said, the look of silence, I'm humbled by this, has helped along with the act of killing catalyze a national conversation about what happened in 1965, replacing silence and noisy celebration of genocide. It is truly unimaginable that that could happen without the help of Anonymous and Adi Rukun. So to them again, I echo Sina's thanks. The silence in the title, The Look of Silence, also refers to our silence. The 1965 Indonesian genocide is not just Indonesian history, it's also American history. The United States government supported the genocide, participated in it by providing weapons, money, and the lists of thousands of names of Indonesian public figures that the US decided would be likely supporters of the new military dictatorship and wanted killed. The US embassy handed th those lists over to the Indonesian military and asked them to check off the names as they worked their way down the list and give the list back when they were finished. Nevertheless, the details, the full details of the scope of our involvement, how much money was given, what kind of weapons were given, whether and, and exactly how determinate that was of the scale of the slaughter that followed, remains classified. And the United States' rhetoric about human rights will correctly and understandably be seen as a hypocritical ruse for advancing American strategic and commercial interests until we find the courage to acknowledge our own human rights abuses. I hate to end with a kind of appeal, but the 
two films, The Look of Silence and The Act of Killing, prompted U.S. Senator Tom Udall to introduce a resolution demanding that the United States government declassify the records that would reveal exactly what our role in the crimes were. And I hope each of you will support that effort by urging your senators to support that resolution. You can do that by going to the film's website, thelookofsilence.com slash participate and or sign a petition urging your, senator, your senators to support Senator Tom Udall's resolution. Finally, thank you so much. This is an enormous honor. Thank you, Anonymous. Thank you, Adi. Thank you. <laughs>